what is up guys this is Danny for Duotech and welcome back with another video so in today's video I'm gonna be talking about five tweaks that is gonna be compatible with the uh, iOS 9.3.5 the most the tweaks that I'm gonna be talking about which is gonna be in the description down below and even uh, if you need or you're looking for sources uh, you will be found in the description down below so with that being said let's get it started okay so the first one that i have for you guys which is going to be a fly me charge and what is the tweak pretty much is going to be providing you with is going to be giving you a nice and beautiful widget you can set it on your i device and this is how it's going to be it looks like when you set it on your i device which is going to be give your device nice and beautiful looking in order to download the tweak you need first of all to download the lock html4 so if you're looking to download the lock html I will leave the source for you guys in the description down below so you can uh, download it add the source and then you can download the uh, lock html4 okay so just to give you guys idea how is that going to be work after you download the lock html4 on your i device go ahead and just enable the bond here and then uh, once you download the widget you will be find that widget that you already download under the select widget so go ahead and tap here and then as you guys can see this is the one that i already downloaded which is going to be the fly me charge from here select this one and go ahead and plug your uh, i device and then you will be find the i widget working on your lock screen just like the way that i show you guys so as i told you guys uh, you will be find the name and even the source in the description down below if you want to uh, looking to download that i widget on your i device fly me charge okay guys so i'm going to be talking with you guys about the next one which is going to be the olympus and what is that week is going to be providing you with is going to be set and nice and cool stuff on your switcher and what i mean about cool stuff because there is more than one stuff you can just run that on your switcher if i want to go right now to my switcher as you guys can see right now this is the way or the layout of my switcher and if you want to go and swap you will be go to see your media player with the full page here also if you want to go and swap one more you will be find most of the toggles that you have and you will be able even for your business light here uh, slider to have an access on it okay so the first thing when you go to uh, under the settings you have the interface here so once you reach the interface here you have two uh, toggles Go ahead and enable those you have to enable and then you have the smart switcher also the other thing we have the gesture mode here so if you want to go it's going to be providing you with more than options so you have the control center and then you have the open app switcher and then close the current application so uh, i'm using the open app switcher and then the music screen style so you can use the uh, light and the dark mode so mine i set it on the dark mode the way i show you guys how it's going to be looks like and this is most of the things under the settings so when you download the tweak and as i show you guys the olympus is really amazing if you want to download it on your iDevice i highly recommend you guys to give it a try olympus okay guys so the next one i'm going to be talking about the flat safari url so uh, pretty much i think the name just explained himself and uh when you download the tweak that week is going to be giving you a nice and a flat looking once you use your safari browser so if i want to go and use my safari browser right now and to show you guys how is that going to be it looks like so this is the way of the style when you download the tweak is going to be giving you flat looking for your safari browser just like so and this is how it's pretty much the tweak is going to be providing you with under the settings there is nothing to configure the tweak will be work right away once you set it on your i device so if you like to download the tweak the tweak called flat safari url all right so the next one and what i have for you guys which is going to be the repower and when you when you download the tweak that tweak is going to be giving you more than option when you set it on your i device to giving you guys example and how is that going to be looks like so if i hold my power that's going to be giving you three options and then uh, this is the options so the first one if you want to power off your device and then the other one which is going to be if you want to reboot your device the third option if you want to respring your device and then if you want to cancel that so this is the way of the tweak when you download it on your i device 
So if you want to go under the settings, tap on settings here. And as you guys can see, only the only thing that you need to do, just uh, toggle or enable the tweak and then the tweak will be work right away on your iDevice. And this is the way of the repower when you download it on your iDevice. Okay, so the last tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be for sure the Spring Tomize 3. And the Spring Tomize, it's already available and it's working compatible with the iOS 7, 8, and 9. So when you download the tweak, that tweak is going to be giving you and allow you and it's going to be providing you with a lot of stuff. So if you want to go and jump under the settings of the tweak, you will be see a lot of stuff in the tweak. As I said, it's going to be allow you to customize more than thing like control center your doc your folders your account your live screen your notification and more than that so uh, once you go in every single section you will be find some customized stuff which is going to be give your device really beautiful and nice set make sure always when you work on spring to mice and when you change any kind of option you need to just respring your device after every single change so your device will be take the effect i told you guys it's really amazing if you don't know what is the spring to mice is going to be allow you and what is going to be providing you with make sure to give it a try spring to mice 3. i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for my channel for more videos like this and i see you guys and catch you guys in the next one peace